Hello, everybody. I am Constance Willingham with John Moore. And hey, everybody. this is Main Street with Constance. Indeed, it is. And John. So, what are we talking about today? We are going to talk about one of my favorite things that we do here in Pikeville. <laughs> and I am, I am wearing my shirt to celebrate the Pikeville Cruise In. Yes! Yeah, but before we get to the cruise in part on that Saturday and every first Saturday of the month, well, through October, no, through September anyway. We yeah. have a farmer's market at 8 o'clock in the morning. Yes. Yes, we do, with fresh fruits and vegetables. Yes, and also there will be a summer night market for the cruise in the live music also. Awesome. Awesome. And and let's see, so we've got farmer's market, the beginning one, starting from 8 and going until 12. Yes. And then we pick up with the cruise in at 4 o'clock. Right. And it goes to seven, and at yes. the same time, the summer market, the summer market, market at night. And also, we have something additional that will be going on: the World War II uniform. uniform. Yes, I forgot the rest of the part of that. Well, that's that <laughs> well, is. Well, we've had it before at the library, where you see a progression of the uniforms during that time period. Right. Of uh, men and women's uniforms, and they will be on the courthouse lawn. So you can't miss them. It's an exciting piece of history if you don't know much That's about right. World War II, or even yes. if you do, for the folks that might have lived it. Uh, for those of you who uh, didn't and weren't even born that during that time, it's, <laughs> it's really historical and great information. It is. It is fun. We had fun the last time when they were at the library. Uh, people walking around in the uniforms and all their paraphernalia and everything. Yeah. It's very interesting. So, And we've got a lot of history in Pikeville, so that's just a tiny portion. Yeah, and that's from 12 to 4, right? 9 to 4. Uh, excuse me. That is 12, 12 to 4. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Got confused. Okay, well, and then after the uh, cruise in from 4 to 7, we have the live band <laughs> Legacy. As always, Pikeville has some rock and roll going on this week. Now I have a question. Now, before we get to the live music, in their music in between there. Oh, well, yeah. And then people in the cruise in get tickets for some giveaways. That's right? true. That's yes. true. Okay. We will be playing uh, recorded music in the in the uh, in the street there or on the square, I guess, uh, here at the stage. I'm not sure exactly where we're all set up, but uh, once John the cruisers will be setting up. Yeah. Well, once the cruisers come in, we'll be giving them a ticket, and they'll turn their ticket in to me at the booth for the drawing at five o'clock. Yes. And then we'll have a second drawing at ah, six o'clock. Two drawings. That's right. So okay. make sure that if you bring a car and participate in the cruise in that you stop and get a ticket and turn it into me or you won't win a wonderful prize okay yeah that sounds like a great thing what Anything kind of cars else? do we have oh we've had corvettes we had the batmobile we had that truck from um, it was a wrecker yes a yes. restored wrecker from derby city that's been relocated to the tennessee area corvettes jeeps anything you can think of just about mustangs yeah Sally wasn't in it though. No, but Mustang Alley event is over with, so we might see some more Mustangs this time. You know what I want to see more of, and we only had one last time, is motorcycles. Bring your hog down, or your Kawasaki, or your Suzuki, your full dress, or your sidecar. So, motorcycles, uh, we've even had a hearse before. Yeah, we did. So, whatever you got. Um, we had a person with a old fire truck, but due to weather, he didn't make it. So, I'm still looking for that fire truck to show up. That's right. Okay. So don't be bashful. Bring your vehicle down. Don't you know, pull it out of the garage. Show it off a little bit. We'll see you at the cruise in September 7th. Yes. Hey everybody, stay tuned right here for more information for Ain Street with Constance. Brought to you by Bledsoe Telephone Cooperative, your full-service telecommunications provider right here in the Sequatchie Valley.